Passenger Seat EP is about a journey of the highs and lows of a relationship, but it kind of travels backwards. I wrote Young and Numb after the breakup, looking back and thinking about how I wish I didn't have to go through these feelings of the fallout. It's really sarcastic and it's just a bunch of things I'd never say out loud in real life, so I had to write them as lyrics. Run away like hands do in the dark. Anthem is from the perspective of being right in the middle of this messy relationship and the crazy cycle on and off, back and forth. You know you're just going around in circles, but you both keep saying the same things to each other to make each other want to come back. Don't leave me stranded in this ocean too deep to swim We fucked up and it's our anthem and we sing There's a lyric in Money which really sums up the whole song for me, which is If you turn my love into currency, I gotta spend it on me. It's about those people that make every interaction feel like a transaction, and how we're better off spending that energy on ourselves. It's also from a time where I was working two jobs, trying to write an EP, and also do tours, and just fantasizing about, you know what, when I actually get what I'm working for, I'm gonna make sure I really enjoy it. There's so many huge artists writing songs about how money can't buy you love or, you know, I don't need money to have fun tonight. And this song is from a broke artist, kind of saying the opposite to that. It's just about getting shit done. Too High to Cry is about bad habits, drowning your problems, like I can deal with these feelings tomorrow but tonight I'm self-medicating. There's a spoken line sample in the bridge from the show Skins, the first line that you ever hear Effie say about how everything feels back to front and upside down when she's spinning out. This song is for those moments. Once, in the early stages of dating a person, we decided it would be a good idea to go on a road trip together for 12 days, locked in this van, driving around Australia in the summer. 
You really get to know someone fast in a situation like that and in a way you can predict all the ways you're going to either work well together or be bad for each other. That trip was also where I started all of the demos for this EP. Sitting in an RV with no Wi-Fi, drinking red wine, playing card games. It felt like being in another world with just the two of us away from everything we usually do. It's like the calm before the storm you know is coming. <laughs>